Hi Stampers! I'm so excited to be starting my Technique Tuesdays and to show you today this particular card and the technique that I want to look at is this, I call it a flick technique. So uh, we're going to start out by taking a piece of Whisper White card cardstock. Of course, there's your Whisper White. And we're going to do two things. We're going to put a color here and we're going to put some glitter here if you can see that. We're going to do the technique exactly the same way. I'm just going to put a drop of Always Artichoke Reinker on one of my blocks. You could also use one of the plastic clamshells or anything else that's not going to be an absorbent thing. You're just going to mix the reinker with a little bit of water and then take your brush and just flick it. You see how the color gets on there? Okay, and then I would give that a minute to dry. In the meantime, wash out my brush a little bit here. I would take some white glue. Now we have the Tombow Mono, which is a great white glue to use, and I'm going to do exactly the same thing. I'm going to add some water to the glue, mix it around. This just happens to have a little bit of green reinker still in there. And I'm going to flick this directly on my white Whisper White cardstock. But after I do that, I'm going to take some of the Stampin' Up! Gold Glitter and I'm going to be able to add glitter to my project, giving it that flicked appearance as well. This card is easily finished up by adding your washi tape. You can use any colors that you have. I love washi tape because you can just tear it. That's very forgiving. And then I'm taking some of our new Into the Woods designer series paper. This is like this on one side, and it's actually a wood grain on the other. That's in our uh, mini catalog. And I just punched out one of the circles from the, of the flowers that you can see on here. Okay. And on next onto that, I would add from our new Acorn Builder Punch, which is here. I stamped, or I uh, punched out an acorn out of the um, cedar sheets, you know, that come in my husband's cigar boxes. And I added a little bit of espresso for the top, just punching that out here. I would place that right over there. And then I've stamped the thankful from the, the um, Stamp set, a corny thank you that also goes with this. And place that over there. I would then mount it on Hello Honey and Cajun Craze. And you have a great little card. You can see my original card, I added a little bit more glitter. This one I added a little bit less. I think it would depend on what your um, preferences are. But I hope you like this technique and you try it at home. Thank you.